have to reach the Empress before Corythius. The only question is, how? We know how. I have our way in. The real question is, where is our enemy hiding? At the urging of Grand Duchess Florian, the Empress is holding a ball. Absolutely everyone will be there. During the festivities, Celine will be meeting for peace talks with the usurper Duke Gaspard and Ambassador Briala. The assassin must be hiding within one of these factions. We shouldn't waste any time. Let's go to the Winter Palace. The political situation in Halam Shiral hangs by a thread. The Empress fears our presence could sever it. The Grand Duke is only too happy to have us at the ball as his guests, so our invitation comes from him. Whether we act as his allies or upset the balance of power, he gains an opportunity, if not a clear advantage. Inquisitor Trevelyan, it is an honor to meet you at last. Imagine what the Inquisition could accomplish with the full support of the rightful Emperor of Orlais. I can see many benefits to such an alliance. Keep the image firmly in mind. We may see it materialize by the end of the evening. I am not a man who forgets his friends, Inquisitor. You help me, I'll Prepared to shock the assembly by appearing as the guest of a hateful usurper, my lord. They will be telling stories of this into the next age. It's a pleasure to meet you, Duke Gaspard. I look forward to ending this civil war. As do I, my friend. The Empire needs stability and security now more than ever. If you have the safety of the Orlesian people at heart, Inquisitor, this elven woman, Briala, I suspect that she intends to disrupt the negotiations. My people have found these ambassadors all over the fortifications. Sabotage seems the least of their crimes. That sounds like something I should look into. Be as discreet as possible. I detest the game, but if we do not play it... We're keeping the court waiting, Inquisitor. Shall we? Is that the Inquisitor? A mage? No, there must be some mistake. From the Circle of Ostwick, so they say. Pardon me, my lord. You have... It was a gift from the Countess Montbelliard. Enchanted by the Fomari. I cannot go in... What's your game? Are you trying to... Or just gain importance by getting the Inquisitor. I assure you, the ring truly is lost. And I must find it or risk terrible repercussions. Maker, what am I going to do if I cannot find my ring? Is this the ring you... You are a treasure. You have saved me a lifetime. Is that the Inquisitor? And now, the Maker.
This is a private conversation. Please leave. Interesting. Any word from the front lines? My spies said the bodies were beyond counting. Surely the Empress will put an end to the war tonight. Pray, my friend. If the Maker does not hear us now, just pray. Inquisitor, a moment, if you please. I must warn you before you go inside. How you speak to the court is a matter of life and death. It is no simple matter of etiquette and protocol. Every word, every gesture is measured and evaluated for weakness. I'll keep my guard up. Don't worry. The game is like wicked grace played to the death. You... When you meet the Empress, the eyes of the entire court... You are safer in the Fade with the Fear Demon. It might be a good idea for the other... Especially Sarah. I'll have a few... Everything will be fine. And Rasta watch over us all. That's useful. I heard the Grand Duke invited the Inquisition. If nothing, 
Just gossip. Just gossip. That's useful. And now presenting Grand Duke Gaspard de Chalon, and accompanying him, Lord Inquisitor Trevelyan of the Austric Circle of Magi. <laughs> Shepherd and leash of the wayward order of Templars, purger of the heretics from the ranks of the faithful. He is so full of it. That's not how it went. Champion of the Blessed Andraste herself. <laughs> Did you see their faces? Oh, priceless. Accompanying the Inquisitor, Seeker, Cassandra, Allegra, Portia, Calogera, Philomena. Get on with it. Pentagast, 14th cousin to the King of Navarra, nine times removed, hero of Orlais. Right hand of the divine. Madame Vivienne, first enchanter of the circle of Magi, enchanter of the imperial court, mistress of the Duke of Gislaine. Her ladyship, my balls each, of course. <laughs> Sir Callum Stanton Rutherford of Honley, commander of the forces of the Inquisition. For Cousin, my dear sister. Grand Duke, we are always honored when your presence graces our court. Don't waste my time with pleasantries, Celine. We have business to conclude. We will meet for the negotiations after we have seen to our other guests. Inquisitor? Lord Inquisitor, we welcome you to the Winter Palace. Allow us to present our cousin, the Grand Duchess of Leeds, without whom this gathering would never have been possible. What an unexpected pleasure. I was not aware the Inquisition would be part of our festivities. We will certainly speak later, Inquisitor. Your arrival at court is like a cool wind on a summer's day. I'm delighted to be here, Your Majesty. We have heard much of your exploits, Inquisitor. They have made grand tales for long evenings. How do you find Halam Shiral? I have never seen anything to equal the Winter Palace. We hope you will find time to take in some of its beauty. Feel free to enjoy the pleasures of the ballroom, Inquisitor. We look forward to watching you dance. Inquisitor, a word when you have a moment. Please allow me to present to you my younger sister, Yvette Gabriella Montillier. Delighted to meet you, Lady Montillier. <laughs> Inquisitor.
Thor, I've heard so much about you, but not as much as I want. Josephine writes, but she never tells me anything. Is it true? You and Josephine are going to elope and move to the Anderfels and join the Grey Wardens and fight Darkspawn? Yvette! I want to know. Rumors exaggerate many things, Lady Yvette. It sounded so romantic. This may be my only chance to hear about when Josephine was a girl. Oh, yes. As she told you about when she was ten and... Yvette. Stop. Fine. Uh, what about when we were climbing the cliffs by the... No. She once told the Duke of... Absolutely not. Hmm. She still plays with her doll collection when no one's looking. Yvette. That's absurd. Absolutely preposterous. <laughs> Tell me about yourself, Lady Yvette. This is the first time I've encountered any of Josephine's family. She would forget to mention the artist. I've been studying painting on the... And I must wait for your tutor's deals. Gaspard has run military campaigns, but never... Enjoy... I see me... The dancing is so dull, your worship. Yvette... Sorry, Josie. Go on, Josephine. Half a royal must be empty. So many of the Empire's fi They've noticed the Empress paying you special attention. This uncertainty won't last long, I'm afraid. Another... What were they doing in the Western Approach? It's a wasteland. How could the Emperor Crutch afford up? to renovate the Beats palace? Without what were He's going on? I heard that it wasn't renovation at all. The palace was what a fun, close marrying crowd. He fired on the Winter Palace with monsters. Any hidden treasures from friends of your little network? You mean, do any of the servants burying tarts between these windy... I'm not saying yes, but... Wait, yes I am. There's some good stuff hidden around. Keep an eye out. Making any new friends? <laughs> no. They're all glances and titters. Not sure if they're allowed to like you yet. Pathetic. Back soon. Not going anywhere. And here we are. You haven't embarrassed yourself as much as I feared. Well done, my dear. Any words of... Speak to the Count. Six of them are here tonight. The seventh member of the Council is... His absence will call... The Council are the highest ranking players of the game. They see everything. They might know something we can use. I've always wondered... We all wear masks. Who you are as a son, a lover, a friend is not the same man who speaks. Or lesions code of... By giving each of these selves its own separate face, they believe they can be their truest selves, unmarked. Anything happen? Strange that I haven't seen much of Gre One could always find her clinging desperately to the Empress's skirts before. It seems like... This is the game, Inquisitor. Of course I enjoy it, if I didn't. Tell me, Vivienne. What I want is irrelevant, darling. Orle requires stability. You ready to... Always. Laurent was the love. Perhaps we can speak later. I heard Celine was having the entire wing Did you decorate? The sooner we track down this infiltrator, the better. Why would she do, do you such have a thing now? Legion social events. There are a few here we can trust. Be careful. Who do you? The Spards claimed Orle needs someone capable of responding to the crisis at hand. You've attracted a following. I don't know, but they won't leave me alone. I take it you're not... At this point, the headache I'm developing is...
preferable to the company. Have you noticed? I'll let you know at once if I do. We'll talk. I will. For all the drum saves here. Good. I was hoping it would catch you. What did the Duke say? He points the finger at Ambassador Briala. The Ambassador is up to something, but she can't be our focus. The best place to strike at Céline is from her side. Empress Céline is fascinated by mysticism, foreseeing the future, speaking with the dead. She has an occult advisor, an apostate I've had dealings with her in the past. She is ruthless and capable of anything. That sounds exactly like the person we're looking for. She's worth investigating. Both leads point toward the guest wing. It's a promising place to start. I'll coordinate with our spies to see if I can find anything better. I will be in the ballroom if you need me. Serving drinks. Bother someone else. Interesting. The package is in the guest wing. Upper room. The one of the garden. Statuette. Get these pastries out to the diplomat. Gaspar is wasting his time. You don't want to be here, stranger. He hasn't made the pickup. It's been hours. He went into the servant's wing. Philippe should have returned hours ago. Dallying with some serving girl while I deal with Gaspar's vitriol. Awfully selfish of this, Philippe, running after... I've half a mind to inform the Dowager. That would teach it. The night of all nights, leaving me to convey Gaspar's death threats to the Council. Wonderful time. Thank you for listening to me. He hasn't made the pickup. It's been hours. He went into the servant's wing. Nobody's come out of there all night. I'll tell Briella we have a situation. Interesting. Did you hear what Gaspar said to Duke Germain? His own uncle. Germain bore his nephew spite better than the rest of the council. Did you see that panicked attaché roaming about? Well, well. What's this?
Well, well, the Inquisitor. Here as a guest of my nephew, no less. I'm curious. I didn't know the Grand Duke was your nephew. He's my brother's eldest boy. Always a difficult child, Gaspar. He was raised a prince. All his life we told him he would be a... What else should he do with his life if not fight for his destiny? Another time. Waste of time. of time. Yeah. 